All right, so I went back to trying this coffee grinder again, and it worked way better than this grain grinder that was making way too much dust. Uh, the last pucks that I made, I don't know if it was just, I added 2.26 grams of uh, dextrin, and I don't know what happened, but the, the pucks were rock hard. Um, maybe it's because I wetted it with 50% ISO, so I'm trying to narrow down what happened. But this time, I just went with 2 grams of dextrin, and they weren't quite so hard. It was a lot easier to grind with this thing. But what I did first was I hammered it into uh, the pucks into a Ziploc bag and, until they ran through this quarter-inch um, mesh, and then... Uh, Put them in here, grind it up, and uh, dumped it in this 20 mesh. Uh, and what sat on that was basically like 1F or slightly bigger. And then just running uh, this metal cord over it just to run through. And what sat on this 30 mesh is 2F. And look how much I got. That is great. And this is the, the half pound recipe. I wanted more 2F because I want to just use my muzzle loader more. I'm just, I just want enough 3F right here, which sits on uh, 40, 40 mesh. And this is one of those screen, you know, pan filters. So you're always going to end up with a lot of waste and you just repuck it again. It's not waste, but uh, it'll just keep getting better with more density. But. Yeah, I just wanted enough 3F to test the 45 Colt, but I was doing the 45 Colt and the 2F, but I wanted to test them both. But yeah, that's that's pretty good. I'm excited. But uh, yeah, there was something else I was going to mention. Um, I got a ton of like basically 4F or higher of the, the mixed hemp that I'm going to compress. And the bass fiber um, powder that I got to repuck. So definitely uh, using this more often. I removed the O-ring that kind of seals it. Because it's just with the dust on it, it just didn't want to stay down. It was like popping itself off. So I don't need that um, at all. But it's a ceramic grinder. This thing is the Poliviar on Amazon. I think it was like 30 bucks but yeah it works great um i kind of want to cut this opening just bigger just take this door off just but it wasn't too bad taking a spoon and just dropping it in but yeah this this is working great um i kind of want to do another burn test and uh add it to this video i took the mo moisture meter not very good at talking in videos, I'm sorry. To the pucks, and I got zero reading. Which is awesome. Tells me it's really dry. Look how much moisture is in on your skin. So yeah, Let's see if I can add a little flash test for this 2F.